A voltmeter is a useful tool to determine the voltage of the battery and check the vehicle's charging output. However, it does not provide the full picture of a battery's state of health. For this, a specialist conductance tester like the GSU Asa GYT250 is needed. A voltmeter test will test the battery's voltage at that moment, however, it gives no indication of the battery's starting performance, so it cannot be used as a measure of health. It can, however, be used to identify potential charging issues. If these are present, we would advise taking your vehicle to a local workshop or garage. Before working on your battery, make sure you have followed all health and safety instructions and are wearing the appropriate PPE. Check out our other videos for more health and safety advice and only attempt the following if you are confident and technically competent as these tasks are undertaken at your own risk. To use a voltmeter to check the voltage of your battery, it is essential that the voltmeter settings are correct. Check that the black lead is connected to the COM port and the red to the volt port and set the voltmeter to DC volts on the 20 volt scale. Connect the voltmeter probes, red to positive, black to negative, ensuring that a good connection is made. Allow the display to settle and check the battery voltage. Despite being called a 12 volt battery, typically the voltage of a conventional flooded battery type should be 12.6 volts or above. However, this figure could be lower for modern EFB or AGM battery types due to their operational differences. For conventional battery types, 12.4 volts is the key figure, as anything below this can start to cause irreversible internal damage if the battery is left for a period of time. It is important to remember that voltage alone is not an indicator of battery health and therefore should not be used as a reference for starting performance.